Hey everyone, it's me again. As everybody knows, oh, what's that? You didn't recognize me? That's okay. I don't always look like the schlub that I do after I've been running. Sometimes I look like this. <laughs> Anyways, as everybody knows, I'm injured. I am so injured, but we're working on it. Um, because I'm injured and because we're working on it, I thought this would be a perfect time to do a K-tape versus rock tape review based on my experience and based on my opinion, K-tape and rock tape. <laughs> so I went to Academy this weekend and bought some K-tape because I wanted my husband to tape my foot uh, because I was going to do my first run in almost four weeks and I thought the extra support would be good. So K-tape comes in a package like this, looks like this. It costs $16 for about 16 feet, so about a dollar a foot. And um, it's very, very simple to apply. It's very stretchy. You pop this tape and then you stretch it and then put it on to your injury. And it's really pretty. It has lots of colors, lots of fashion colors. For those of you who are into it, you know I'm so into fashion. Um, those are the pluses to K-Tape. The drawbacks to K-Tape, in my experience, is number one, the cost. The cost is expensive, and it better work if I'm going to spend $16 or $17 on it. The durability lacked. I was taped on a Sunday. I went and ran on a Monday. I got a shower after I ran, and the tape was already starting to peel away at the edges on my foot, which really annoyed me because I'm thinking about the cost. Um, and I'm also thinking about my injury, and I want that tape to stick in place for a couple of days to really give me some support. Uh, the stickability of K-Tape is once you lay it on your injury, let's say this is your injury, and let's say you had a little crinkle or something and you had to take it up and then reposition it, Wherever you reposition, that stickability is now compromised. For $16 or $17, that's not what I'm looking for. I need to have my tape really be functional and always for me. It's very lightweight. You can't really see it here. Oh, my phone! It's very lightweight. And um, the biggest drawback to K-Tape for me personally is that it comes in predetermined sizes of strips. So you basically take a strip off. Each strip is this size. I rarely use a teeny little strip this size for any of my injuries. So that, quite honestly, ticked me off tremendously. <laughs> <laughs> and yes, it takes a lot to tick me off, <laughs> but for the money and for the support that I needed, I just, I just, don't, I wasn't feeling it, K-Tape, and I'm sorry, but I, I wasn't. Why I would use K-Tape and why I will use the rest of this roll-up, because let's face it, I paid $16, $17 for it, is when I have a beginning of an injury, a very slight in a uh, beginning, you know, of an injury where you think, ooh, is that something? I will use K-Tape on my runs for those because I want to use this up. But I can't honestly say that I will be purchasing K-Tape again. So yesterday I was talking to my friends at Arosti, and yes, they are my friends. And you know what? If you go and see them, they would be your friends too. Uh, about this tape issue, and I came to find out that they use rock tape, which is different than K-Tape. So they told me to come on down and get me some rock tape. So I did. I went there today and got me some rock tape, which of course has their name on it. Who doesn't love that? I love it so much. And I got the blue and orange for my high school uh, Bobcat team. Um, <laughs> but the cost to this and this, it doesn't come this size and then this size. Uh, rock tape and K tape will come in this size. They each run about $17.00 or $16, about a dollar a foot. So that's a wash for either one. Um, the durability for rock tape, it's a beast. That stuff stays put. I have had uh, rock tape that has lasted over a week. Um, so I absolutely love it. I don't feel like I have to kind of walk gently when I'm barefoot if it's on my foot, or I, I, I feel like I can live my life when I'm in when I have been taped by a Rosti using their K-Tape. Now I have never used it before myself, so husband will be uh, trying his hand at rock tape probably next week because I just was taped today. I'll show you that in a minute. 
Um, the stickiness of rock tape is phenomenal. This stuff just works like a beast. It's 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 not as lightweight as the K tape, um, but it seems like today when I was taped, it seems like it's compressing things and putting things where they need to be. Whereas the K-Tape felt like it was on my skin, but it really wasn't quite. It was like the difference between wearing a well-worn running shoe and a brand new running shoe. You can feel the definite difference in support. So for my personal injury, I needed a beast of a tape. And Rock Tape, Rock Tape is the tape that I will be buying from now on. I love it so much. Um... If you sweat, if you get wet, if you uh, rub up against stuff, not that we're always rubbing up against stuff. <laughs> my point is, it's very durable, people. So um, let's see if we can see my, try not to look at my shorts. I forgot I had these shorts on. Woohoo! Okay, this is what I had done today. As you can see, they really tried to stabilize my foot. So, because I'm having issues today, they did my Achilles, they did my. Uh, heel pad. So um, I feel like I have a compression sock on almost. That's how good this tape is. <laughs> and now that I've had the K tape on, I feel like this is like a prom dress and these are a farmer's overalls. So there's a huge difference in, in what, what I'm getting personally out of each tape. So there you have it. If you have an injury, or if you're an athlete, you're going to have an injury, that's for sure, and you're going to want to be taped at some point. Um, just as an aside, you can look, there's a whole library of videos on YouTube on how to K-tape and how to use rock tape. So if you want to educate yourself on that, go right ahead. <laughs> that's what I did. Um, and also, people want to know, why do you wear this tape? Does it really work? I'm asked that every single time I have uh, something taped on me and yes it actually works basically what happens is the tape is placed on the top of your skin and then it kind of pulls your skin away from your muscle a little bit so blood flow can go in between that space and so inflammation can get out of that space and so it promotes healing and I'm here to tell you people it actually works I've noticed a huge difference when I'm wearing K tape or not K tape just any tape rock tape um, <laughs> than when I'm not. So I hope this helps everybody. I hope that, uh, that, you know, it's been a little informative. So I would hate for you guys to go out and buy something that didn't work for you. So you just pick your poison, whether you need a little for K tape or you need a lot for rock tape. Um, you do what you do, just like I do. So you guys have a, a good week and stay safe and I will see you soon. Adios.